Everybody, good Tuesday afternoon to you. Uh, we've been watching the satellite here, and, well, it looks pretty good overall. Lots of sunshine out there. Now, we do have some clouds coming in here from the west. It looks like any of the precipitation is just staying north here of the Canadian border. Uh, now, we do actually have another system moving on in, some stronger upper-level winds starting to move uh, closer to North Dakota. You can actually see them pretty neat here uh, coming off the uh, Bighorn Mountains there, and you can see some of the clouds forming as these upper-level winds do uh, move over the mountains. But in any case, good chance for some rain overnight tonight across our northwestern counties keep that in mind after that we're also tracking the potential for severe weather yeah we're uh, starting to get into that time of year severe weather chance for tomorrow across our southern counties just a marginal risk but a potentially greater risk develops Thursday and that will be uh, very true for our far eastern counties and it actually looks like it could be a big event off towards our uh, neighbors there in Fargo and Grand Forks so that's something we are watching too. Uh, as far as lows tonight cloud cover across the northwest and uh, well pretty much everywhere is going to keep those temperatures pretty mild uh, overnight lows only into the 40s and low 50s highest tomorrow temperatures uh, warming up to the 60s and potentially low 70s to the southeast uh, where we do have uh, cloud cover continuing through the day across the northwest that's where we'll have highs only in the 50s. We'll have the very latest on uh, the potential for severe weather coming up at 5 o'clock. We'll see you then.